makes you deaf. Casey Jones, West Drive. The train is clear, Casey.
has been a while, ladies and gentlemen. Run about, you know? Yeah. Oh, who's excited to be back out here to tweet you real and have fun? Woo! Woo! I have missed this. But what with us being away for so long, and nobody's been checking the telegraph office, so there is a pile of messages we gotta go check. Damn Penny, go get to reading. I hope someone remembers my birthday. When was that? Alright, let's get on over here! Get on. Okay. This is going to be your final resting place, buddy. Woohoo! You know, I hate to say this, but you two don't really look like a lawman. I got the answer to that one. It's because we're not. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, Ooh, you know who I am? Absolutely. You, sir, are Leslie Lehman, the bank manager of the Frontier Outpost and the richest man in all of these parts. <laughs> I say you shoot it. We can't do that. Because we got a robber first. <laughs> May? What? He said May. As in the proper way to ask your question, sir, is May I please say something? Okay. Well then, may I please say something? No! Oh, please, let's just focus here. What, what are we doing? Alright, Otto. Keep driving. You guys stay focused. But don't worry. We're going to be singing and dancing all day long. Once we send you away, <laughs> and it ain't no lie, baby, bye, 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 bye. Oh, right now, Lester, we know that you got some move on that bank right there, so let's chop, chop, shall we? Okay. Yeah, before we lose our patience and get ugly. <laughs> oh, they must have been born without patience. <laughs> oh, honey, look over there. Hey, what's going on out here? Whoa, Marshall. Ain't nobody getting robbed on my watch. Oh, well, then, what time do you get out there? <laughs> well, I guess we'll just have to wait until six then. Bye bye! Ain't nobody deserves to get robbed in broad daylight. Marshall, you are absolutely right. So, if I might suggest, let's just shoot him. What? Wait a second. Don't I know you? You yeah. know you are yeah. yeah, you know me. Oh, well, what's your name? Oh, uh, my name uh, it is Lester! Lester from Tulsa! From Tulsa, yeah. Lester from Tulsa? Yeah. Oh, Lester from Tulsa? I don't know any Lester from Tulsa. What? 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 Oh, 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 God, I think I stopped. Oh, no. I'm Jesus, stand out! Help us! Now that you shot that innocent man, go give him a frostbear. Will do, Marshal. Uh, Debbie, how about you say a few words? Serendipitous. Hippopotamus with his quipadiliophobia. Uh, <laughs> yeah, good enough. You two, get back out here. You boys are in a lot of trouble for trying to rob a man without a license. I heard that they were taking Indians from babies. Oh, damn. I heard they pulled a off. Well, that was me. That was me. That was me. That, there, is capital offense. Toilet paper is worth double its weight in gold these days. What? What if what me and Otto did was so bad? What about your deputy? What about, what about him? He just shot a man right... What man? <laughs> Where's he at? Hello. Right here. Right here. Hey, man. Doesn't you all pretend to shoot us or someone in broad daylight? That way he can get away while well, we distract the bad guys, because the bad guys are a bunch of idiots for me. Oh, <laughs> it gets y'all every time. How do we so learn to read? Now, just what were you boys doing then out here in your prisoner, anyhow? What do you think? Oh, no, no, Maddox, I got that answer for you. I don't know. We're going to clean out this here. I And it robs every single person on the <laughs> Just tell me we're going to do it. Yeah, that's. Well, boys, I hate to be the bearer of bad news, but there ain't no gold on this train. What? We do got plenty of lead, though. Sure. Will you do the honors? With pleasure, Marshal. <laughs> We're well, well, open. You want to get the dynamite? You want to the thing? Ah! Oh, that was not the plan. We hired idiots. You know what? I'll lay on the 
away. Hold on. Uh. <laughs> oh! Who ordered Taco Bell? <laughs> ah! Uh. Well, Henry, that was fine work. Uh, Yosemite, if you would step uh, to the middle so I can keep an eye on both of you. Uh. Now, Sacramento, what do you think would be a beef fitting punishment for a pair of ne'er do well such as these? Oh, I know. We can make them do a little song and dance for the people on the train. Oh, no, 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 no. No, no, no. You're right, Sacramento. That would be funny, but I think that might qualify as cruel and unusual punishment. Oh, Sheriff, don't worry about it. We are great performers. We came in second place at the Tweetsie Talent Show. Not to you, you goober. For the people on the train. You know what, Sheriff? I say we take these two to Fort Boone. I heard the Cooper Bob is doing a little bit of renovation and could use a helping hand. Oh, oh no, no, no physical labor, please. My hand, my three hand, don't get all housed up. Be stressed, don't give me a clean coat. Y'all look at wine and I'll give you a face lift. Good idea. Ladies and gentlemen, we're heading into some dangerous territory. If you got firearm, get it loaded. I'm gonna need all the help I can get. Let's go. All right, Casey, let's get this train on up to Fort Boone.
heading up steam. Just watch the drivers roll. And look at the smoke from that old smoke stack. And listen to the whistle I think that I will make this my home. And settle down right here. Spend the rest of my days on the Tweetsie train. And be a junior in the Alright, you two. Buy the barrels and I don't want no lip, alright? Alright. Hey, uh, you mind if I ask what, uh, what are we doing out here? We are here to drop these two off at Trooper Bob so that way they can't cause any more trouble in Tweetsie Town. Hmm. Well, I don't mean the crime, you boys, but it looks like Trooper Bob is slacking on the job. Yo, Timmy, what did I say about that? Back to the barrels. What is it? Uh, Debbie, if you were over here, please, no, just for a moment. Uh, I hate to give credit where credit is due, but that bandit might be right. I don't like, uh, I don't like the looks of this place. Seems weird to well kept, and yet, at the same time, not. So, what we're gonna do, is I'm gonna go in, see if I can find your vlog, see what on earth is going on. And, uh, while I'm gone, you're gonna stay out here, and keep an eye on the bad guys, alright? Sounds good, Sheriff. Wait! What did yeah. they start acting up? I mean, you only give me one bullet per day, and I already had to use it. Back. I know that. You know that. Now the train knows that. But those two don't know that. So use your head. Use your training. What training you have? And uh, just do your best. All right. All right. All right. Thanks. Here's what's going to happen. I am going to go into that fort, try and find Trooper Bob. While I am gone, the deputy is in charge. His word is law. Do you understand that? Fantastic. No funny business while I am gone. Now, Sheriff, you know that I've never done a funny thing in my entire life. That is exactly what your train car told me. Amen. Hey, you, how dare you? I hate to be a burden there, deputy, but weren't you supposed to be watching the three of us? Of course. One, two, three. Oh no! Where's Lester? Oh man, this is my chance to prove myself when I'm messed up. Looks like you're in a pickle there, deputy. <laughs> hey Otto, didn't I say that I was an excellent tracker? Uh, you are. Mm -hmm. Wait a second. If you're such an excellent tracker, how come you never mentioned it before? Mm -hmm. Well, I'm mentioning it now. Right. But I have that yet. How about you let me and Otto three, and we can help you find poor old lost Lester. And the sheriff doesn't need to know. Well, I guess I could use a couple extra sticks of hands and eyes. Uh, fine, but no funny business, all right? We promise. All right. Let's go! go. Ooh, fiddle there, Dad. Wow, that was much easier than what I thought. Well, all right, Otto. Let's go inside that floor and look for Lester, see if he has any cash on him. Oh, yeah. That way this entire trip won't be a waste of time. Oh, Yosemite, don't kid yourself. This was not a waste of time. Think about all the memories we made. Robbing this here train, making all these kids cry, and it's not a glitch yet. On this time, for Mr. Lester. Goodness gracious. Oh, goodness, I thought I'd never find that bathroom. Oh. Days, so I guess we're gonna have to take him back into Tweety Town, put him in the jail, find a lock for Lester! What are you doing? It's not what it looks like a promise. Well, what is it? Sure is. I got knocked out. Again. Man, I had a feeling this might happen. Alright, you two, turn the cowboy up. I quit. We have got to hunt down those two bandits before they walk, rob us blind and say something dumb like, uh. <laughs> Not so fast there, Sheriff. Looks like we got the drop on you. Yeah, something like that. Ha <laughs> ha! We did it, 
We've got the sheriff in front of the witch! Well, fellas, I gotta hand it to you. It would appear that you have won for once. I just got one question for you. And what's that? What are you gonna do when we fight back? When? Ah! Oh, that's so funny. Railroad theme park continues to 
special place in the hearts of generations of visitors. Bridges of legendary rail carried away in fun, adventure, and a lifetime of memory. This sprang up all over the place as settlers moved west. Prospectors dug and sifted for gold, silver, and gemstones. Then the railroads came here in the 1880s to haul iron ore from the mines to the city. As towns sprang up along the tracks, the railroads made daily trips hauling lumber, supplies, mail, and passengers. It looks like our train trip is just about over. Thanks for riding with us. I hope you'll get a chance to come back and ride again. New things are always coming to the Wild West. Come back and ride with us again soon. Bye-bye now.